four years old, and I'm dying. For some reason, as of recently, there's been more and more hate going on in the underground for no reason. Like, all of a sudden, everyone hates osama son. I'm basically saying, you come around me acting funny and I don't know you, or you think shit funny around here, you're gonna get shot in your shit. Everyone hates Netspan, everyone hates, like, everybody who's coming out. Niggas are starting to hate on Laser Dim. Y'all, I ain't gonna lie, I think this whole generation might be cooked. I might be cooked, your moms might be cooked, your pops might... Nigga, why was I listening to this nigga music? It was so ass that it started sounding good. This nigga music is garbage. But I'm like, nah, I ain't gonna lie. This shit low-key tough as hell. Nigga, the shit was so ass that I was paying attention to the bars and this nigga was spitting. Nigga said, trap so old, gotta run out the house when I play my music so the roof don't fall on me. Bro, I swear, TikTok ruins everything. I already had a video on this, bro. TikTok ruins everything, bro. This trap so old, gotta run out the house when I play my music so the roof don't fall on me bar is being fucking ran into the ground bro that shit is so annoying bro like damn niggas can't have nothing bro fuck tiktok what did laser dim do he, he he just been himself this whole time you know what i'm saying but niggas just like to hate on things that get popular just to feel different it happens every single time so that fuck boy doing cracking i'm like kick him off Talking on my baby mama, get punched in your mouth. Now, no hate to my nigga Jamari here, but oh my god, bro, look at this comment. He's not even bad, but the hate memes are so funny. When the beat fire, but Nat Spence start rapping, like, oh my god, bro, you're so fucking Now, I'm a victim to this. Some of my past videos, you know, have, you know, done the same thing. Now, I still do believe Nat Spence is ass, like, subjectively but i can see the appeal to his music like i could listen to like you know two of his songs like we not like you that's fire but as of more recently you know popular artists like uh ian aka the new generation's yeet even though it's already the new generation i don't get it now people are starting to hate on him people are saying he's ass and when he first blew up with that snippet, everybody was on his dick. My dick better like Marshawn Lynch. He run through somebody. She done caught me on a bad day. Hope so perfect, it ruined my headspace. Now all of a sudden he's ass? Same thing with Net Spend. You see everybody back then, they was glazing the fuck out of that one snippet. Bitch, I'm in the bitch, I, bitch, I call. Y'all don't miss my party, that's for sure. Niggas was sucking him off for that shit. And as soon as he got popular, as soon as he started doing shows, doing well, you know, succeeding. <laughs> started to hate bro it always fucking happens now me i can say i was a di like a day one net spend hater now i can acknowledge that you know some of his songs have appeal to them but uh, from day one i was always like yeah this is that shitty music you know what i'm saying because lil wayne's son did the same exact shit as net spend and niggas called it trash because he was black that's all i'm saying <laughs> Nah, never mind. This is really that dog shit. Hey, if a white boy would have done that shit, he would have went viral. If a white fucking 13 year old boy would have made a song like that, he would have went viral. But since it was Lil Wayne's son, he has all this shit, all this pressure on his name to be a fucking rap god. Like, niggas didn't like that shit. You know what I'm saying? Niggas just want to hate on whatever's popular, bro. Now, what I can say is justified hate is that one nigga who sounds like Glock 40 Spaz, but he's just white. What a cuss. nigga is a direct clone he is a shadow clone jutsu straight up nigga niggas in the underground just love to hate on shit that's popular nobody likes to like it's the same thing with diddy bop everybody started hating on him for no reason he just did the same thing over and over again like like how can you get mad at a nigga for that imagine just sitting there writing a whole paragraph on why you don't like another man bro like hey, you stare into the camera and you post it on tiktok you're you're gay yeah so i've noticed there's a lot of haters on my page so i'm gonna give you guys two options the easy way, talk to the hand, or the hard way, mess with these hands. Caught you off guard there. There's a lot more where that came from. Niggas got mad at Kai Sanat because, oh, he's too loud, even though y'all are the ones who blew Kai Sanat up into the fucking moon. I, I'm, I be on Twitter, and I could take a break, and people will get pissed, and I'll see, like, a whole bunch of, like, it could be a hundred positive comments. Mm. Turn off my phone. Really? Yeah, I just literally, it's either I just turn off, type out the app, turn off my phone, and just 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 like wake up the next day or the next day or whatever i'm doing i just
go hard. So unfazed. Yeah, I, I be unfazed. Like, if you let it get to you, bro, it, it could get real bad. I don't see people that let it get to them, bro, and it could get real bad. Like, once you once you feed into it, I've seen people reply. Mm. Like, replying to a hate comment is actually insane. Like, once mm. you give people yeah, that... once Yeah, once you give people that satisfaction, bro... I They're gonna think, keep doing it. Now, also, I did want to address this, um, Glock Kitty. Now, if you do see this, you might not. I don't give a fuck. Um, you know, I apologize. Hopefully, we could be friends in the future, maybe more. You know, hit me up on IG, follow me, or follow me back on Twitter, you know what I'm saying? But, um, if you haven't, check out the video in the middle of your screen. Probably very entertaining. And I'll see y'all niggas in the next one. Have a good day. Peace. Up in a fun, in a dim. Body wanna sum me up and fun for no reason. If I ever said that I love you, then I mean it. I'm gonna break her back, break her back like Tampa Pete.